attached to the end of this powerful telescope is an equally impressive camera to record what the telescope sees. It's the largest camera ever constructed, measuring about 3 meters long and 1.6 meters wide, designed to capture ultraviolet, visible and near-infrared light it uses a robotic arm to place filters in front of its sensors. Named after the Legacy Survey of Space and Time, or the LSST, the camera will support this decade-long sky survey. The LSST camera is made up of 189 individual sensors and outfitted with three large fused silica lenses. Each exposure covers 10 square degrees of the sky giving it superb optical performance. That is quite a wide angle of visibility. One single image can capture an area of the sky equal to about 45 full moons. If you compare these stats to previous surveys like the Sloan Digital Sky Survey, the LSST is essentially doing every three days what SDSS took 20 years to do. SDSS steadily built up a map covering 35% of the sky over its 20-year run, but the LSST can map the entire visible sky in the Southern Hemisphere, or 50%, with every 3-day scan. <laughs>